Hi friends, what's up? This is our K phone 360 reader. It's time to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix can't transfer issue between iPhones in iOS 16 or later. iOS 16 has come up with a number of pretty notable features, including the ability to transfer issue between iPhones with utmost ease. While this feature is pretty reliable, many users have complained that they are not able to transfer eSIM. Just in case you have also run into the same problem, this video is for you. That all being said, let's jump right in. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our youtube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 reader first and foremost i would recommend you to check out the five most important requirements before transferring issue between iphones make sure your iphone is running ios 16 or later make sure your iphone is unlocked besides make sure to keep your iphone near do know that your iPhone must be passcode protected. If the passcode is not enabled on your device, go to the settings app and then scroll down and tap on face ID or touch ID and passcode and then turn on the passcode. Last but not least, make sure Bluetooth is turned on. If it is not enabled, go to the settings app and tap on Bluetooth and then make sure Bluetooth is on. Alternately, you can swipe down from the top right corner or swipe up from the bottom edge of the screen to bring up the control center and then hit the Bluetooth icon to turn it on. Next up, I would recommend you to hard reset aka force restart your iPhone. For those unfamiliar, hard reset is well known for fixing common iOS issues. Therefore, it is worth giving a try. To force restart your iPhone, you have to press and quickly release the volume up button. Then you have to press and quickly release the volume down button. Then you have to hold down the side button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Once your device has rebooted, try to transfer ECM to check if the problem is gone. If it has, then it's time to rejoice. After that, I will recommend you to reset the network settings. Whenever my iPhone is faced with any network related issues, I make sure to reset the network settings. Credit where it's due. More often than not, it is able to help me. That's why it's worth giving a try as well. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone and then tap on general. After that, you have to scroll down to the bottom and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Then tap on reset. Then tap on reset network settings and then confirm the action. And finally, I would recommend you to update your iPhone. If you haven't updated your device for a while, chances are pretty high that there could be a hidden software bug at the heart of this problem. To get it done, you have to open the settings app on your iPhone and then tap on general. After that, you have to tap on software update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS as usual. That's all there is to it. So these are the best tips and tricks to fix. Can't transfer issue between iPhones in iOS 16 or later issue. Hopefully you have finally overcome the problem. Now let me know the trick that has worked for you and if you have found any other trick that works in fixing this issue, make sure to let me know that as well. And I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.